Greetings, I am Sanika Arrington and I just wanted to do this, take a moment to actually share with you who I am as Sonika Arrington. I am Sonika Arrington, the Positivity Queen. I want to tell you, thank you first of all for just allowing me into your life and just for this few moments to take in a moment to listen to me and connect and um, be part of my world. Um, so I started traveling since 2013 internationally and um, I, before I start, began traveling, um, I worked at the airlines and um, I got to meet some really interesting people working at the airlines. And on one particular day, I met this um, elderly lady, I call her auntie, she was from Zimbabwe and she was headed to South Africa Johannesburg and her ticket was like really expensive she missed the flight and we got to talking and building and I was like wow auntie I wish I could come and join you and she was like come come join me yeah that would be awesome now I had just got my passport I had maybe seven or nine days off and um I just took a risk and I went with this lady to Africa. Now, I'm from Queensbridge, New York City. You always hear that New York City accent and I'm New York for life. And uh, taking risks and, um, you know, just being quick thinking and trusting people, trusting my instincts. And it connected me with a wonderful lady who took me back to the motherland. And once I got there, my whole body was like reset and my whole thought was share Africa with my family, share Africa with the world because the pictures that I had of Africa or what I would see growing up was nothing but negativity and poverty about Africa. But when I got there, I was able to see the beauty and the richness that Africa had to offer from the people who were just loving and the food that was just absolutely delicious, the spices and the different uh, creativity and the artwork and just the realness and I was just excited sharing this with people. So as I started to began to travel, I would go all the time I had a moment and with the opportunity of working at the airlines, I could fly for free practically, um, just paying taxes and fees and I would just go to so many different countries and Africa and European Europe and in Asia and I got to exceed see the world and experience people and I wanted people to see and experience the things that I that I was experienced because some people back at home they never left their block they they never left their borough they never ventured outside their state let alone to a whole nother country and I wanted to show people from I, growing up from a little projects to being able to see the world and connect with so many people and as I started to do that more and more people started knowing me as the Queen of Africa at work they would say oh that's the Queen of Africa she's always going to Africa and so that's how I got the name Queen of Africa the positivity Queen I got because everybody's around me they always saying you're so happy you always positive you know so that kind of stuck with me and I began out as Eve the Jewel Hunter you'll hear people call me Eve as well Eve the Jewel Hunter because I'm always connecting people places and things that inspire greatness I think that the more you surround yourself with great people and positive energy you you feed off of that and it's nurturing and, and it, I give it back to others I love exotic things, new things, I love learning, and I find that the more you travel and connect with people, the more that you see your differences, but at the same time, it, you have so many sim similarities, and um, you, you recognize what your purpose in life is, and once you recognize that purpose in life, your purpose in life, you go for your dreams, and any and everything is possible. I mean, with a lot of hard work, um, with some help, and determination and focus, yes, your life can be possibly become any and everything you want it. And so my goal is to become an entrepreneur, to connect millions of people back to Africa, be it if you're from the United States of America, the Caribbean, and Africa, that, you know, I've grown up thinking that we're so different because I'm here. Yeah, we have different um, cultural aspects, you know, of how we were all raised and morals, but we're all similar. You know, we are one. You know, we got dropped off at different ports. However, I've learned through my travels that we are still connected. You go to Africa, you see someone look like your cousin doing the same thing, and, uh, 
it's just beautiful so i'm inviting you to come and experience africa with me and share in the love the investments the wealth the fun the spirituality and if it's your calling come join me queen of africa or africa for the africans dot org and we're going to bring you we're going to just reset your whole body just let you fulfill that that goal giving you the luxury giving you the realness giving you the love giving you the positivity giving you the truth giving you the roots you know giving you the sexiness giving you that fun and that spirituality and that wealth you know so come boy next trip the next trip to ghana with the queen of africa is going to be march 12th 2020 until march 17 2020 it's a six day land package only for $1,299. Come and let me give you the best of the best and tell you why you're going to love this investment. I'll see you in Africa. Be amazing. And thank you for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. We are one. <laughs>